touch dry for So it. we've we've it's uh, pretty much touch dry the uh, two pack aerodite on the uh, front of the uh, turtle. So that's um, sealed up nicely on the top half, and we now need to um, just do more or less the same thing for the for the bridge crack which we looked at earlier, mm -hmm. and we'll flip them over. Awesome. We'll try and get the uh, best angle proper possible for you and uh, we don't need to fix it. We'll, uh, we'll seal up this other side. Cool. Is that a big Let's go. angle there? So, the crack is right through this bridge here. Now, for whatever reason, turtles, reptiles are, they're an amazing creature, they'll survive more than we could have ever have imagined. When we first started doing this, um, a turtle that was this badly broken would uh, almost certainly have been uh, euthanized. Fortunately, we've um, we've been very lucky to work with uh, some amazing vets. Um, Howard Ralph was the first person that showed us this technique, and um, we're, we're fortunate that uh, Bungadore vets, Michael and Stacy, will have taken this on as well, a and others at Bungadore, of course. That's um, that's just the first part of the uh, the denture post. There's quite a big crack in here, so we'll, um, we'll we'll probably just put another one inside that just to get it right. I actually think we've probably just enough in there. It's probably just sealed, so. Um, We'll, uh, we'll two pack out without this one again and um, get it sealed up. Um, two pack out right takes approximately 24 hours to seal 100%. So um, it's uh, 9 o'clock on Friday, the 14th of March 2014. And by tomorrow, this guy will be uh, in, in the water with uh, some of our other uh, turtles. and. Uh, Hopefully swimming again, and uh, we hope to get him feeding again within a week or so. And uh, yeah, all being well, he'll survive. So w wounds like this, um, we, we tend to keep an eye on for. Oh, it, it's likely to be uh, somewhere between twelve and eighteen months for this guy, but. Um, He's, um, he's had a full course of uh, antibiotics, which is injectable vitro, um, to avoid in infection in this wound. Yeah, he will have. I'm trying not to stick his feet in the glue. But, uh, yeah, it's, um, this is becoming quite a common practice now with um, turtles. It's... It's not an unusual thing. They, um, as I said earlier, they're amazing survivors. They, um, they can be cracked, bashed, battered, flipped over sixteen times by a car, and they'll they'll pull through. Um, which is great. These these guys can live for uh, what we believe is eighty to ninety years. So that we'll just let that dry off. Um, he'll have a overnight. He'll be um, on heat. To uh, to keep him alive, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll we'll video again tomorrow when um, we put him into water. Should be exciting. Thank you.